brand like Cheerios, to begin with, we've mapped the genome uh, of oats because we wanted to get to higher yielding oat varieties. We wanted to develop varieties that were more drought tolerant and needed less chemicals and fertilizer. So we've you know, invested in that science and innovation. And then as we're making the product, we separate out the oat holes, uh, which are a byproduct of those oats. And we're using those oat holes to generate electricity, creating steam that supplies 90% of the needs of one of our mills in Minnesota. So there's innovation all the way through the manufacturing uh, process of that great brand Cheerios. Our mission is nourishing lives, but it does go beyond that. I mean, we also talk about, uh, you know, our desire to nourish uh, the communities. And General Mills has a long history of social engagement and community engagement. We give back in so many ways, whether it's supporting schools, uh, the United Way, or hunger relief, and not only with money, over 80% of General Mills employees are volunteering in one way or another, which is among the highest level in the country. And now as we expand internationally, uh, we're bringing that same set of values to plants uh, around the world. The interest that consumers have in health now is very, very deep, and we find when we're able to combine the benefits of great taste with a great health benefit, consumers really reward us. We set this goal of trying to figure out if we could make all of our cereals either a good or excellent source of whole grain. We had to engage with a lot of R&D partners around the world, but we were able to make every single General Mills cereal either a good or an excellent source of whole grain. We're now at the point where General Mills cereals alone alone are providing 10% of the whole grain in the American diet due to that innovation that we started seven or eight years ago. This is another area I think that demonstrates how innovation underpins everything that we do at General Mills. And as a food company sourcing for agricultural products all around the U.S. and all around the world, uh, we believe it's very important for us to take steps to reduce water usage, energy usage, to reduce greenhouse gas emissions coming out of our plants, to reduce waste, to reduce packaging. And we've set goals for all of those, uh, you know, to, to reduce all of those. And we think we have a, a unique responsibility in the whole area of sustainability, given our extended uh, footprint, which goes up into the um, agricultural part of the food chain.